high noon on May 16, 2011, in the Monday edition of the Daily Journal is upon the streets. Mike Fry here with Nicole Leonhardt. Nicole, the rain kind of put a damper on the annual Rhubarb Fest at the Small Memorial Park yesterday. But nonetheless, you found a sweet story over there and it ended up on page one. Tell us more. A mom and son enter the pie baking competition together, uh, bake their pies together, but refuse to help each other or share recipes. I guess he kind of destroyed the kitchen, but first pie ever baked and he wound up winning first place. And uh, even though his mom was the reigning champ, she couldn't be mad because today he's leaving uh, for the Coast Guard training in New Jersey. So it was just a good a good memory for them right before he left. Indeed, a sweet story. Uh, like you said, though, the rain dampened the uh, event somewhat. Is it going to get better, Nicole? The whole weekend was wiped out, basically. You know, it looks like it, but Rachel reynolds Susie has the forecast. Good morning, everyone. Sun finally came out after a whole weekend of rain and gloom, and I'm just so happy to finally see it again. And guess what? It's going to be so nice the next couple of days. Today it's going to get up to 57 degrees, and it's going to slowly warm up right on through the end of the week where it's going to be up into the 70s. Tomorrow it's going to be 60. Wednesday it'll be 66, and then we'll just continue to warm up from there. Nicole, we are back, and last night the Eastern Conference NBA uh, playoff series started between the Chicago Bulls and the Miami Heat. Luke Skywalker versus Darth Vader, if you will. Good versus evil. And guess what? Good conquered evil last night as the Bulls defeat the Heat and LeBron James 102-83. I'm happy. How about you? It looked good. Um, always exciting to see uh, a team so close by making it. Um, but yeah, I think they more so good destroyed Evil. It was a great oh, game. Oh yeah, the Bulls just clamped that defense down and LeBron and his teammates could not respond. So hopefully that will continue on. The Heat will end up on the sidelines and the Bulls will end up in the NBA Finals. Stay tuned, News at Nooners. Next game's Wednesday. I can hardly wait. Nor can I. That'll do it for the News at Noon. You can subscribe to the Daily Journal by calling 815-937-3322. You can also pick it up on the newsstands. And so until tomorrow. Stay informed.